It is the National Sensitization Workshop for Critical Stakeholders in the Administration of Criminal Justice in Imo State, Southeast Nigeria. Those in attendance include officers and men of the Nigerian Police Force, officials of the Imo State Judiciary, amongst other stakeholders. The workshop, which is feeding of the Imo State Administration of Criminal Justice Bill 2020, is aimed at reawakening the consciousness of the justice sector and institutions involved in the administration of criminal justice to ensure that there are no unnecessary delays and encourage respect for human rights. There is no doubt that there are novel provisions in the AJA and in the Imo State Administration of Criminal Justice Law that require strict implementation by major players and critical justice institutions in the state. The message from the Solicitor General of the Federation is that of optimism that the implementation of these laws, already enshrined in the 1999 Constitution as amended, will address the human rights abuse and maltreatment of suspects at police stations and detention facilities of other security agencies. Section 33 of the Act requires an officer in charge of a police station or an officer in charge of an agency authorized to make arrests to, on the last working day of every month, report to the magistrate the cases of all arrests of all suspects arrested without warrant within the limits of their respective stations or agency, whether the suspect have been admitted to bail or not. Participants pledge to collaborate with appropriate authorities in the state to ensure the effective implementation of the law. Enough. I want to make bold to tell all the participants that the force has not been resting on these powers. If you look at the caliber of police officers here, most of them are area commanders and divisional police officers. They are conversant with the act. They have attended a series of uh, training sessions. Even the command under the leadership of my Amiable Commissioner of Police at Apoki Tanjuma has been able to organize uh, lectures on this. Amongst other benefits, the Imo State Administration of Criminal Justice Law 2020 is expected to promote transparency and accountability in criminal justice administration in the state, facilitate the decongestion of police detention facilities, enhance better image and perception of the police, and ensure the suspects are not illegally detained in police cells. Ejitokokute, Channel Television News.